I had an epiphany that I could make history, that I could prove everyone wrong that told me I wasn't cut out for this music thing. Yeah, I had an epiphany. What if I took my energy? What is up, guys? It is me, RF Jordan. Today we will be exploring the infamous Mars Hill Church here in Ottumwa, Iowa. This place is very haunted, supposedly. It's supposed to be one of the most haunted places in Iowa besides Stone King and Harvey. But yeah, we'll be checking that out today. We'll be checking out the cemetery right there. And then I've got a little bonus feature in this video for you guys. So yeah, subscribe, leave a like, drop a comment. Let me know what you think. RF Jordan, out. Hey guys, so we are here at Mars Hill Church. Um, you can see the, the glow of the surveillance cameras. Don't do anything stupid, there's surveillance camera. <laughs> Not that I'm saying you do something stupid, but... I know better than to accept the Huh? There's like cans of stuff in there on the seat. You see the cemetery. Oh, are you recording? Yeah. You see in there? The yeah. the cans or whatever the fuck? Yeah. Yeah, that is inside. <laughs> you can see all the way up there. What's that called? An altar? Yeah. Yeah. Damn. Yeah, yeah this church was established sure. in 1850. Um, I don't know when it burned down, but it did burn down and was restored. It wasn't super recently. It was... Um, Early 2000s, 1900s. Early 2000s, 1900s. <laughs> Somewhere in there. Probably Google it and find out. But yeah, you cannot get in this church. It is padlocked. <laughs> they they have an actual security system, and they're... Oh, that's something else that's not. But there's a camera over there. Yeah, I got it. More got the Wi-Fi router in there. <laughs> awesome. What? There's a Wi-Fi router in there. Up See the green oh lights? my god, that's funny. <laughs> but yeah, this is supposedly one of the most haunted places in Iowa. Got our old haunted church and got the Wi Fi hooked up. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, the ghosts it's just like to chill and watch YouTube. Mm -hmm. uh, god, it's crazy. So, once again, before we get too far into this video, um, do not oh, vandalize god, such as this. Do not do that. You feel that? Yeah, I don't yeah. like that. If you do go exploring, do not vandalize, because as you can see, there's plenty of headstones knocked over here. Jesus Christ. Almost all of them are knocked over. You know, people just can't fucking leave people alone, even when they're dead. <laughs> do you think people do that, or do you think that, like... Well, if you look at stone, way. if you look at stone things, I definitely think people did it. Mm, yeah. Now, this one, I just think it's simply... The world doing what it does and during the weathering stone fall apart and shit like that so well it's like the reason i think it's people is because stone king's still like really good condition yeah well, and i stone think it's actually king's a different story i still haven't seen it I would like it's to. very it's smaller than this stone king's scary it's terrifying yeah yeah i know you can't see but there's probably about a hundred yards of cemetery that's the church right there. Um, it's got a parking lot that's where we parked our car. One singular street light. We're in the middle of nowhere, by the way. This is probably like a good six miles of gravel in the middle of nowhere. So not quite Stone King, but it's still very, very secluded. Straight from your horror film. <laughs> See, like, I think, so what you guys were saying the last time is Stone King is just out there. Oh, this right? is the star I was talking about, and you're like, oh, let me Oh, they left quarters. I wonder what that means. Oh. Um, uh, that, I believe, is Jewish. Mm -hmm. okay. That's the Star of David, I believe. That's what I thought, too. Um, died Probably in... coins to help him, like, pass over as, like, you know, like, the fair or whatever. So if it tells you how old the cemetery is, it says they died in 1876. Damn. Or no, that might be 1870 even. I can't tell. It's a little worn. As you can see, that last one is a little it worn. Looks like, it looks like 1871. You think so? Yeah. It might be, yeah. Never mind. 
That might be a colon. 18. Yeah. That, that looks like a colon. No, um, it's like 1871. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 1871 colon. And then you so can read the rest of the So, thing. there's a little light peeking through the trees right there because I'm shining off onto the road. Um, to the left of that, about 50 yards, is a house. I'm wanting to say that might be like an undertaker's house or something. <laughs> yeah, it is very cold. It's like, what would you say? It's like 20 degrees out? Probably. I don't think it's that cold. Well, see, the, cold. see my breath? That's how you know it's a cold night out. Hey, look, feathers. Oh, no, that's not feathers. My bad. <laughs> don't mind me. I'm still. I thought it was feathers, too. Same. We got this very scary tree here that's like falling apart. It's actually kind of pretty. Looks that's like it might have got struck. Yeah. yeah. That could have been what it is too with the headstones. Maybe. Well, well yeah, we are on top of the hill. And that's like the tallest tree out here. So it makes sense. That'd be, that's weird though with like the headstone. Yeah, like almost every headstone here is knocked over, which I'm not saying people did do it, but. That's not what you do when you come and check out places like this. No, it's fucking rude. I'm just saying that right now. I mean, you have to drive it out. Well, another thing is, a lot of these, I see all these veteran, uh, all the veteran stars, but none of them have the flags by them, which is really weird. I don't think it's very well tended out here either, though. Yeah. See, if you... Unfortunately, people vandalize, um, but even if it's not vandalism, if you come out here and you see, for example, like headstones just laying on the ground like that, it's always nice to at least prop them up. So, you can at least see their name, show some respect. But since this is one of the most haunted places in Iowa, of course, kids and adults who identify as kids are going to come out here and trash the place, which is very, I cannot stress how much, is very not okay. <laughs> oh man, it's chilly out. But yeah, I apologize for the lack of commentary on this video. This place just kind of speaks for itself. Yeah, back here. It's really weird because back here they all start standing up. Um, there's of course some broken ones, but mostly standing up. There's woods all the way back there is what freaks me out. <laughs> yeah. These ones are probably fine because people aren't really coming vandalizing the day. They come at night and then they're too scared to come any further back here. So I was about to say, these ones look more well adorned than the ones in the front. Mm -hmm. The ones in the front are completely... You see all the stars out tonight. Wow, it's beautiful out here. Yeah. <laughs> but alright, so I'm going to have to ask you guys to turn your flashlights off for a second because I want to show them how dark it is out here without the flashlights. So everybody's got their flashlight off. Last one but me. This is what we see. Behind us, we've got the street light, of course, but other than that, it's just Darkest. really dark. <laughs> other than the stars, which, well, the stars are really pretty. It is a very clear night out. That's always nice. You can actually see constellations. <laughs> yeah, you can almost see the Milky Way. Like, it looks like that's it through here, like, right overhead. That's crazy. Maybe. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's a baby one. That was crazy. Coyote house. That's my cue, right, babe? Four. Oh, yeah. Ah! And that is not what you do. Sure it is. Ah! That baby sounds sad. It might be calling for its mom or, um, it's learning to hunt and it's trying to lure another animal to it. So look at my look at my phone. You see how you see that bright red light? Yeah. The camera shows up way brighter on here. That's a that That's bright weird. red light is a security camera. <laughs> it's weird how they show up so much brighter on the because that's a really dim camera. It's just really bright on my phone. <laughs> another reason not to vandalize. Security warning. Yeah, these signs are new, they don't do that.
little little rundown of what this place is. But yeah, as you guys can see, that's there's an old wooden fence and a gravel road, um, and there's nothing around other than this place and that house down the road. I'm gonna take you a full lap around the church real quick. So that that light over there is where we just were. That's the window on the other side. This window's a lot cloudier, like a lot more. It's not condensation, it's dust on the inside. No, I I really think it's better. It feels better. It felt better. There's look at the inside, it's a very small church. One of the is this the oldest or is it just one of the oldest log churches in the United States? The back There's of the no church, security camera. Out in the middle of nowhere. I mean, look at the field out there. Like the surrounding ones. Is just yeah. Like so as you can see, there's the fence post. So I look up um, that red light out. There's a cell phone tower. Um, I would say that's probably the closest civilization. Yeah. <laughs> it's like ten miles away. We so. have Elden pretty close. Other than that, it's just black fields. I think that's a tunnel over there, actually. But then Elden's the biggest. Well, I hear footsteps. <laughs> yeah, I don't hear footsteps. I thought I heard something moving. Like, yeah, I way. hear moving a lot. And then I'm all yelling. Yeah, I heard them yelling in the woods. So and I can swear like to you, I just heard something go move. But I, I heard it too. So maybe I'm tripping off. I'm pretty sure there's cows over the corner because I heard even a lot of people picking up. Oh god, it must be like fucking 30 people. Because oh, look, look, look at the ground. There's like ice stuff forming in the ground. That's yeah, cool. that's pretty much all of Mars Church, uh, Mars Hill Church. Mars Church, we're in church on Mars. Hell yeah. Very small, um, I believe the haunted part's honestly the cemetery, but yeah, thanks for watching. Alright guys, so I have a little bonus feature for you on this video. Um, we are about, say, half a mile away from the actual Mars Hill Church itself. Um, this is the Crybaby Bridge. So, legend has it, a mother in distress uh, threw her baby over the bridge for unknown reasons. Um, water down there. Um, and then she ended up walking back to the bridge, shocked over what she'd done, and she herself also plummeted down, which it's kind of hard to believe a legend like that because it's only about a 30-foot drop. About a 30 foot drop and it's water below. Yeah, legend has it, she killed herself. But yeah, as you can see, um, just straight gravel that way, about a half a mile past the car there. That's where Mars Hill is at. There's a house right over there. Other than that, nothing. But yeah, the reason for all this is because her husband cheated on her. That's the legend. Supposedly, if you sit in your car, turn it off and roll the windows down, you'll hear babies crying. People put the keys on top of their car, too, if they're feeling brave. Yeah, I'm, I don't want to do that. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, should we sh sh shut the car off and listen, then? Do you want to hop in the car, or do you want to um, just... All right, guys, so we have returned to the car. It is officially turned off. Do you wanna, can you kill your headlights, or do you want to keep those on? All right. I'm just listening now. What? What? Fucking sloshing and moving? I thought that was just a lot of moving on its own. I didn't. I swear I hear gravel. Uh, should I turn yeah, the back, back on? on. <laughs> At least turn your lights on. Yeah. Well, the weird thing is, there's no headlights anywhere, though. Very strange. Shall I continue moving forward? Oh, hello, air. It's 
so yeah, supposedly we heard some sloshing on the left side. I swear I hear gravel somewhere, but there's no headlights or anything anywhere. I just heard the water trickling down below there. I didn't hear, like, I heard straight up Is this one of the ones where if you put your car in neutral, you'll go across it? Um, I don't know. Well, because it looks, it looks really flat. Uh. We get moving forward. Something's up here because we should be completely stationary. Right Is your foot off the brake? Yes. Okay. Because I've heard legends about that. Supposedly, something will push your car across. As you can see, that's not happening. Well, it's going to make it just roll across the bridge. Yeah. Maybe it has to be straight in the middle. We did move forward a little bit. Like, we're in drive right now. So right now, we are actually parking right over the water where supposedly everything happened. If you want to leave the lights on, you can. Now we're just listening once more. I hear shit. Yeah, what the fuck? I hear shit. Should I? Yeah, yeah, we should go. Ew, 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 ew. You see what I'm talking about now? Yeah. yeah it was like fucking wet fucking... That was like wet footsteps, like, yeah. That's like what I mud. mean. Fuck, dude. Uh-uh. I was recording. Icky. All right, so I really hope I just caught that. Um, we heard like wet footsteps. I have total chills right now. Oh my goodness, that was terrifying. Like when shit's really fucking muddy, like in a, in a like half dried up creek, and someone walks through, and it's just like their their feet sticking in the mud, like boots or something. That's what it sounded like. That you was pull scary. Your foot free, just all righty well thank you guys for joining us on this adventure hope you enjoyed till next time